Olympics, Lindsey Vaughn picked up the sport at a young age and has since used it to get through most of life's biggest adversities. But after retiring, she's now realizing that she's stronger than she ever imagined. Team 12's Niala Charles shows us where Vaughn is these days in addition to her work with the NBC Olympic broadcast team. Lindsey Vaughn is the most decorated American skier of all time. In 2018, she graced the Olympic slopes for the last time with Team USA. I wish I could keep going, you know? Um, I have so much fun. I love what I do. An emotional goodbye after an Olympic career that spanned 16 years across four Olympics and more than 80 World Cup wins, earning her the title greatest female skier ever. I'm just, I'm proud. I'm proud to have competed for my country. I'm proud to have given it my all. Vaughn's legendary career didn't come easy. She clawed her way to career peaks despite numerous injuries that at times threatened her success. Born ACL, fractures, broken bones, and concussions. But despite it all, Vaughn soared, making Americans proud. Skiing was the one thing that I really that could make me happy, you know, and that was my escape, my emotional escape, my physical escape. But even with all of her medals, Vaughn was fighting another battle, depression. Um, everyone thought that because I was successful on the mountain that I was always happy and I led a perfect life, and that's absolutely not true. After deciding to retire in 2019, Vaughn struggled with depression even more because she no longer has skiing to cope. This is something that really helped me, but it also was my crutch in a lot of ways. Vaughn opens up about this in her new book, Rise, My Story, that details her highs and lows. Her transparency is admirable as she continues to encourage us all to also rise in our own way. Just wanted to share who I am as a person, not just as a skier, and, and hopefully people are inspired to overcome their own adversities in the process. Nyla Charles, 12 News.